Welcome to Scorpio Wolf Tarot. This is going to be a reading for the fire sign of Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Please keep in mind that everything in this reading will resonate with you, so take what's yours and leave the rest for someone else. Also, uh, keep in mind that the roles could be reversed, flipping as you may see fit. Uh, uh, these readings are meant to be timeless, so whenever you're meant to see and hear it is when you're meant to see and hear it. All of us are on our different time timelines and paths, so we'll not all of us are doing feeling the same thing going on at the same time. Uh, you're, I've gone ahead and pulled the cards for you, so let's get to your reading, shall we? So, the overall energy between the two of you is about holding back emotions. And these four pentacles is holding back money, but since this is a love reading and that's how I'm reading this reading, I'm considering the four of pentacles of holding, holding your emotions to the chest. Both of you are holding your emotions to the chest, to your chest. So you're keeping it to yourself. You're not expressing emotions to one another. You're not dealing with emotion with another, one another. And you're kind of not sharing anything going on with that. Everything's close to you. Uh, you did get the Ten of Pentacles in reverse, which is kind of like each one or both of you are expecting this this outflow of emotions and love from one the other person, and kind of you kind of kind of look at it from the, as a lottery standpoint. You're if you're in financial trouble and you're expecting and you want to hit that jackpot, uh, your weight you were in you're waiting to you want your choice the only option is to wait for that job to hit the lotto so that you can get out of your financial troubles well this that's a long shot that's you know you can have a better luck getting struck by lightning that way and, and that's what it's trying to what the universe is trying to say say with your relationship is that you're holding your emotions back until you have some outflow of emotions from the other person and that's that's a, that's a that's a long shot if we, if both of you are in this energy and waiting for the other to you know just out, have this outflow of emotions to, to rectify the problem then you're you're going to have issues um the energy that you guys have is the ten of swords in reverse that's about giving up so i feel that both i feel that you aries is giving up on this relationship um, you have put a lot of, you have overspent, you're in, you know, this four of pentacles is holding, again, holding stuff close to the chest, but in reverse, it's, you're, you've been showing this outpour of a love and emotion and kind of think of it financially too, you know, this is about, you know, the, in, in, in finance, it's about going into debt. So you, you know, you got your checkbook, you got zero, zero dollars in the account and you've been outflow you've still been cashing those checks to you know for a motion to be sent to the other person they haven't been they've been coming out you know insufficient funds so you're going into debt you know you're, so it's one-sided love you're going into debt with that with your outflow of emotions so you're giving up so i kind of feel that you have the you have that mentality of giving up already on this relationship them on the other hand they want to take that leap of faith. They want to take that leap of faith with you. They, they're in love with you. But they don't have the strength to tell you. They'd just rather sit on their emotions. Again, sit on their emotions and wait for an influx of love to come in. Uh, but they're too scared to do it to th themselves. And that's, you know, again, that's causing you to feel that, you know, you're going into debt with this, this emotion. You know, back to the the check balance uh, analogy. But you've given up. You've given up on this. It's it's playing this these emotions close to the chest is not gonna it's not gonna work in anybody's favor. You know, and them not having the strength to show this outpour of of emotions is also not gonna help out the situation. Someone has to step forward in this relationship, and I think, and I think they would have to be the ones that. You know, step forward because you've been the one providing all this and all this love towards them, and in order for you to release that emotion close to the chest, they have to show you it. They have to find that courage to show you the love that they want to give you 
to continue on with this relationship. And I don't think that they have that strength in them right now to do it. Um, not really sure why they wouldn't have the strength to do it, but I kind of feel that they want to take that leap of faith with you, but they're scared to do it again. So what they would secretly want to tell you is that just being near you is intoxicating. So like, they find you to be very attractive. They, it's, they find you to be the person that they want to be with, but again, this relationship has been just a one-sided show. And they don't have the strength to do uh, deal with the to take that leap. They're they're teetering on that ledge, but they're not going to take that leap. They're too scared to take that leap. It's like either they, they're too scared of their emotions, or they're scared of being uh, too clinging to you, and so they're, they're holding back again with the, the uh, four of pentacles. You're holding back the emotions. So that's what I, all I have for you, uh, Aries. Sorry, I was about to say Leo, but we already did Leo. Um, thank you for joining me, Aries. And if you like the way I read, hit that like button. Uh, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already done so. We are up to 30 subscribers as the, as I'm doing this reading. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, we're, our goal is 50 subscribers as we try to you know climb that ladder to the next step. Um, and hit the hit the like button. Hit subscribe, you know, leave a comment if this resonated with you in any way, or if you're dealing with this person that just doesn't want to show emotion to you, and you're, you're thinking of giving up too. So Aries, thank you for joining me, and have a great week.